We made a puzzle that's so precise when you assemble all the pieces, it's completely seamless. Let me show you how we did it. To make these parts, we're using our brand new Sodic AL600P wire EDM. If you've been following our channel, you know Sodic is our new EDM partner here at Titans of CNC. But what is EDM? EDM stands for Electrical Discharge Machining, and it's a process that uses electricity to precisely erode through any conductive material you need to cut. So today, I'm excited to show you the true precision of this machine. All right, so we're a little ways into our rough pass and using the standard technology from our machines library, we're sitting at a feed rate of about 155 thousandths per minute. But what if we wanna feed faster? Normally you'd have to change a combination of parameters like your on time and your off time. But on our Sodic, we have a parameter called easy power adjustment. That allows us to change the aggressiveness of our rough pass by changing only one parameter. So let's put a value in of plus one and see what happens to our feed rate. All right, so as you can see, by changing only one parameter, we went from a feed rate of about 155 thousandths all the way up to about 166 thousandths, which is gonna drastically reduce the amount of time it takes to complete our rough pass. Let me show you guys how easy it is to program these puzzle pieces using our onboard cam software. So I went ahead and pulled up our DXF file in hard NC, and the first thing we need to do is set our origin. So I'm going to click on our origin point. From there, we're going to come down to wire cut depths. We're going to select open, and then we can fill this out with whatever information we need. We're going to hit OK. Here's where we're going to select our technology file from our library. So for this, we're doing a rough and four trim cuts. So we're gonna select the file that has five passes. And we're gonna hit OK. Here it wants us to click on the shape used to generate the path. So we're gonna select our puzzle pieces. You can see they highlight in purple. Now it wants a start point. We'll click our start point. As you can see, the red is our start point. We've got a green lead in line, our puzzle pieces, and then our blue lead out line. From here, all we need to do is select an op stop point. So we're gonna click there, hit confirm, now, all we gotta do is generate our NC data, name our file, and we're done. All right, so our program just wrapped up and our parts look really good, but before I cut them off, I'm gonna take a measurement of our hole. So I've got a 125 pin and a 125 one pin. The 125 pin should go and the 125 one pin should not go. Let's check it out. All right, now that is a beautiful fit on the 125 pin. Let's check it with 125.1. And the 125.1 does not go, so I think we're good. Let's go ahead and get these cut off. If you're interested in getting into EDM, head over to titansofcnc.com, go to the SODIC section of our website, fill out the form, and we'll get you all the information that you need. If you guys don't want to miss any of the crazy CNC machining videos that we have coming, make sure you hit that subscribe button and ring the notification bell. We're almost to a million subscribers and we could really use your help. I'm super happy with how this thing turned out. 
I mean, this just goes to show how incredible CNC technology is. Our Sodic AL600P nailed this thing on the very first try. We didn't have to make any adjustments at all. And thank you guys for watching the video. Don't forget to hit that like and subscribe button. Also leave a comment. Let me know what you think about this puzzle. I'm gonna go play with this a little bit more and we'll catch you guys next time.